I wanted to do a quick video for you guys to uh, kind of go over uh, something that I've seen quite a few people struggle with is making sure that your dog understands no. So a lot of people don't use no. If you don't believe in telling your dog no or correcting them, that's one thing. But a lot of people don't use no the right way. They do a lot of no, 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 or ah, 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 ah. And then they kind of just brush it over and they kind of have the dog maybe go back to doing what it's doing or well it's not that big of a deal they can go and say hi to that person instead of staying on their placemat or something like that so i've got jansen here is gonna um help me with this so my definition of no and maybe your definition of no varies is stop doing what you're doing and go back to doing that thing that i told you to do before if that's a little confusing for you to understand <laughs> breaking it down is Jansen is in place. If he breaks place command and I say no, what he's supposed to do in response to the word no is, whoops, I made a mistake, let me fix it and go back over to place. So I'm going to see if I can distract him a little bit and I'm going to give him the no if he comes off a of place and hopefully he gives us a really good uh, demonstration of what your dog should do when you say no if they've broken command if they've broken command. So if he were in a down stay and I said no, I would want him to lay back down. Or if he was waiting in his crate until I released him and he got excited or he jumped the gun and he tried to come out of his crate before I said so and I said no, I would want him to go right back in there. So things like that. I want him to go back to doing what he was doing and or stop doing what he's doing. So I'm going to distract him and we'll see how this goes. So I don't I don't have his remote because we've done this so many times and I'll show you guys, I'll put his remote down right there. We've done this so many times that just like if I told him down or if I told him place, he understand no means stop. Cease and desist and go back to doing what you were doing. Puppy, puppy, puppy. No. And he goes right back. So. I'm okay with me being distracting. I didn't say anything to him that said, yeah, you can come off place. He just assumed that because I was clapping my hands together and saying puppy, 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 that he could jump off the mat and come and see me. That that was an invitation, but it wasn't an invitation. So let's see that one more time. Hey, puppy, puppy. Good boy. Good job. So that was a self-correction. He basically said, oh yeah, you did this last time and I wasn't allowed to come off the place. So I'm not going to fall for it this time. The only thing that should make him capable of coming off of place with permission is if I, one, release him with a break cue, or two, call him to me. So unless I say something like break or come here that says you're allowed to move from that spot, just because somebody walks in or just because I go to pet one of the other dogs or just because I'm sitting over here, or just because I pet you, all these different things doesn't mean you can come off place. And making sure that your dog understands what no means. No means fix it. Go back to doing what you were doing. You don't have permission to break command. That's going to be huge in giving you more freedom and giving them more freedom. Because imagine if he had come off of there and I had just said, no, 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 no. He would have run up to me. I would have inevitably had to touch him, touch his body, which to him is petting, and then maybe take him by the collar, or if he had a leash, take his leash, and I would have had to bring him all the way back to his place cot, and there wouldn't have been a consequence. So making sure that he understands, no, you've done the wrong thing, you need to go back to that previous activity, which is place, makes it so that he understands quick, turn around and go right back. So that's something that'll be huge for you guys when you start to proof a lot of these behaviors with your dogs at home.